Welcome to Linux Essentials covering your first 100 commands and today we'll demonstrate the ln command. I'm Paul and here's the plan. First the command and why you need it. Second we'll play around in our terminal window and third we'll return for a quick tip and then we're done. Okay we know Linux is the backbone of the internet and is used by cyber criminals and the NSA. At Factorpad we use Linux for fun stuff like financial math. So Linux is great, but it requires that you memorize commands, just like words in a language. And our 21st word or command to memorize is ln from our category system. ln allows you to make file or directory links. Recall from our last video we saw a connection between the command nano to pico, and here we'll sort that out. Before we start, it helps to think of commands as many programs, and most follow this structure, command, options, and arguments. The ln command has 16 options, and there are typically two arguments, the target file and the link name, which is the pointer. Like most commands, help is available here with double dash, and because the concept of links can be difficult, for now I'd just like to draw your attention to the dash s option for symbolic links. So why is ln an important command? Well, ln is widely used on your system already, and you will need to establish links. And now you know how to do that. Oh, a quick word on navigation. This button goes to the playlist back one video, forward one video, and click here for updates. Okay, the best way to embed this in your memory is by typing in your own terminal window. Find this on your Mac using a program called Terminal. On Linux, use Terminal or Console. And currently Microsoft is adding this functionality to Windows. Here we go. Using the echo command from video 19, let's make up words, create a file, and put it in the directory one above here, giving it a ridiculously long file name. So to avoid typing that long name and wasting time, let's make a symbolic link using ln-s, the target, then the link name. Okay, list files, and there it is in a different color and using cat from video 10 to view. Okay, and last, let's revisit the nano pico topic from earlier and let's do a what is on the commands. Basically, behind the scenes is a link pointing pico to open nano. And this is where my system does that. Again, links are very common, so we'll revisit the topic again later. Very good, and as always, exit closes the terminal window. Okay, now you know how to use ln, and you know the syntax for commands, options, and arguments. One last tip about the ln command. The two link types, symbolic and hard, are worth knowing, so please read the help file. Okay, great. Thank you for visiting today. I hope this was a fun introduction to the LN command.